2017. Still retains the services, though, of his first MMA coach, Joe Lopez. Oh, 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 kick for Holloway. Wow. Ooh, oh, that's an amazing combination. So Holloway has Volkanovski on his heels at times here early. Yeah, he's certainly got a big lead. Of course, the wall. that was a good one. Oh, man, he's down again. Spurs on official starting to pile up. Oh, yeah, for sure. He's certainly doing better as the fight's progressing. Got the double underhooks here. Nicely done. Very good takedown, but can he make it count? Yeah, Volkanovski landed. Oh, look at that. That's good work, Alex. Nice job. Got a good entry, pushes him up against the fence, but he's got to get down to the legs. He's on boxing gloves, I mean, we know that, but still, the fact they're throwing with such frequency so often. Look at that! All right, down the stretch here, final seconds of this championship fight. And a late takedown for Volkanovski. The first real takedown. Incredible. The easiest way to find the difference between a fight fan and a casual is whether or not they know how to score a fight. So if you are terrified of being made fun of at your next UFC watch party, don't worry, we got you covered. These are some of the basics of MMA scoring. Effective striking and grappling, ring control, aggressiveness. Effective striking and grappling are considered first. Blows, takedowns, submission attempts that have an immediate or cumulative impact towards the end of the fight are going to count for more points. In other words, the strike or submission attempt should go towards ending the fight. A strike that doesn't seem to have a lot of impact on the opponent isn't going to be as much points. Sports drink of UFC. Early leg kick for Oliveira. One of the reasons why he's different. Oh! He took a couple of left hands him. from Chandler. Oh, Chandler's got a team. It's time to it's real oh, he's, in he's having good success with that low kick. And he has... It's round one of a possible five. He got stopped. He got stopped. Oh! Ring control is about who is dictating the pace and positions of the fight. Who is leading people into their punches. Who is pushing people into corners. Who is deciding when and how they get onto the ground, etc. And he's like 300 strikes ahead of the next person, which I believe is Joanna. We did hear some rumblings. He might try to do some offensive wrestling early. Too easy. Beasted him down. Beasted him down. Beasted him. Right away. For Ally Quinta. But a good sign that he was able to get back to his feet. The question is for how long? That's a tremendous sign. Boom. Right Not very. <laughs> He points out the DC. He's even listening to the commentary team. Right hand. Max Holloway there. Oh my god. He landed a no-look right hand. Max Holloway just looked at the commentary team and said, I'm the best boxer in the UFC. Slipping punches. When he explodes, it's violent. Oh, that looked a lot like James Irvin. Aggressiveness is making effective attempts to end the fight. Chasing with no prospect of a finish is not going to count favorably with the judges. And nearly a takedown attempt from Sean Strickland, who lands another jab and partially connects with a right hand. That right hand got the champ's attention. And it doesn't look like he's doing much, but look at how beat up Izzy is. This was not how I expected this fight to play out. And now Strickland's talking to him. Holy cow. Strickland flapping comes late. Final 10 seconds. Sonia lands a kick to the body. You can win a fight via knockout, technical knockout, submission, doctor stoppage, disqualification, or retire. Gaethje fans being heard from now. About a minute gone by round two. Oh! Round two gets underway. Chandler working off of that jab early. Oh! Knocked down for Oliveira now. Now a knee to the body for Charles. Now right hand. Chandler, oh, Chandler retains it. Now Chandler is down. It's down. Charles Oliveira oh, oh, is the oh, 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 champion. And you're seeing it on the left eye. Oh, made an attempt at a spinning back fist. Oh, oh, oh. Take it. Oh. Chin. Joe, but still on the 
she has got the strength. She She's a real up. smasher. Oh, my goodness. Shevchenko keeping her wits about her. Not under the chin yet. More of a crank. Oh! She's got behind the neck. That's too tight. It's the sub tight. That's tight. It's the sub tight. That's too tight. I think she got it. Oh, she got it. You can also win a fight by unanimous decision when all three judges score the contest in favor of you, split decision where at least two of those judges score the contest in favor of you, or a majority decision where two of the judges score the contest in favor of you and one judge scores it as a draw. As we mentioned earlier, a fight can be stopped due to disqualification. Some of the illegal moves that would either get you points taken away if done too much too often or too intently or the things that could get you a disqualification are things like pile driving, fish hooking, headbutts, 12 to 6 elbows, groin strikes, throat strikes, kicks or knees to the head of a downed opponent, strikes to the back of the head, eye poking, hair pulling, biting, fence holding, and holding shorts or gloves. And that's just some of the illegal moves in MMA. December 9th on UFC. Oh boy. That's the second one. He got one on that replay yeah, earlier. Yeah, yeah, yep, you're he right. He kicked him low earlier. He's doing a good job. Big elbows. No, he can't do 12 to 6. And, and that makes it hard, right? It's easy to say, oh, you got to get out of there. But when oh, beautiful oh. up kick. Hurt her bad with that. Wow, Rodriguez drops her and now going heavy on grounded pounds. Oh, she's got her hurt bad here. Watch your head. Be careful the head. Yes. <laughs> oh, man, oh. he's getting it again. That was, I, I was going to say, that seemed like a oh. headbutt. That, Stop! Oh, wait, that's illegal. Oh. His knee was down. Each round is scored on a 10-point system, same as boxing. So you start the round with 10 points, and if you do poorly, you could go to 9, even 8, or 7 points. This will have each round scoring in favor of one person who will have 10, and the other who might have 9 or a lower number. 10-10 rounds are extremely rare, we usually want to declare a winner for every round. And 10-7 rounds are also extremely rare in that one person has to be completely dominant for there to be a 10-7 round. <laughs>